What's up guys, Dino here, welcome back to my racing channel. Well, that was a little bit of a mixed bag uh, of the three tips. A um, couple of good runs, disappointing run, excellent run. But before we got into the videos, any new subscribers out there, let's hit that subscribe button. Let's hit that bell, you'll get all my videos today, tomorrow, next week and next month. Um, as you can see, there is over 60 plus videos on this horse racing channel that will teach you everything you need to know about horse racing. Um, as I say, from the going, the turf, the jockeys, the horses, anything you want to know about horse racing, it's on this channel. Just click any of the videos, have a look at them, see what you think. Any questions, just drop me a comment and I'll try and answer them as best as I possibly can because um, we're right in the swing of this now on this channel over 60 videos absolutely brilliant um, now let's get into let's start off on a positive and the first positive is going to be winks I don't know if anyone stayed up last night I know here in America it was on I think it was five past one in the morning I understand there's maybe a lot of you ladies and gents working on a Saturday morning and even back in the UK which is po possibly even later than one o'clock um, but yeah what a horse 33 wins in a row absolutely incredible an incredible um, I stayed up and I watched it and as she always does she's about six seven down the field Coming into the street, she makes a run and just absolutely flew up the street. I know she's it's got there that she only won by one and a half lengths, but it was one and a half lengths going on possibly four or five lengths. Brilliant horse, absolutely excellent. Um, and I think that's going to be her last run, which is disappointing. I thought she might have came over and challenged the, the, the UK horses. But obviously she's thought differently, um, or the, the trainers and the owners have. But yeah, what an exceptional horse. And as I say, it's pointless giving you of that as a tip, 16 to 1 on. Crazy. Just totally crazy. But yeah, that's Winx. Fantastic horse. Um, and yeah, Australia, you can certainly be proud of yourself with that one. But yeah, that was another... Another good race from Winks. So, back on to the tips. And we'll start with Magical. In Cruise Control from Mr. Ryan Moore, Aidan O'Brien. It was the class horse of the race. And the good thing is, you got a cracking price. I think it was something like even, well, there you are, even money. Um, in fact, Aidan O'Brien got the first two, and his boy Joseph got the third. Which we spoke about, Flag of Honour and Latrobe, they were all good horses. Um, but Magical was Magical. And that horse will only get better, because I think that was its first run this season. So that horse is only going to get better the next time it comes out. Um, so it's one of Group 3. It will now go into either Group 2 or Group 1 uh, company, because it's one four and a half lanes. And that was in my opinion probably wasn't 100% fit so magical get in the notebooks ladies and gents this is one certainly to follow because it's going to win big races this year not just in Ireland but certainly over in the UK as well alright so that was a winner for us at a decent price of even money um, the next one we picked was Defoe, which if I am being honest, I think Defoe was beat probably maybe two and a half furlongs out. I was a bit disappointed with its run. Young Rascal didn't run up to scratch either. Uh, we did touch on Marmelo. Um, certainly never touched on Aspeta. Uh, Larib we had spoke about briefly. But yeah, it was a... That was quite a strange race, I must admit, because the four just never ran. It was nothing to do with the ground, because it's won on that ground before. I don't know 
what it was, maybe it wasn't, it was only maybe about 80% fit. Um, but in my opinion, if you're going to run your horse in a group three, you to me, you're really looking to win it. So, yeah, it will certainly come on for that, that race absolutely hugely the next race it runs in. So, again, just keep an eye on Defoe. Keep an eye on run Young Rascal as well, because that's not ran to its full potential either. Um, but a fourth, yeah, I'm disappointed with that, absolutely. And the last one, I thought we had this one in the bag. So perfect. Three of them just finished on the line, as you can see, a short head and a short head. I thought so perfect was just going to get up there. Um, but again, it was a, a again it was a strange race. Uh, I know there's 15 runners in this one. So yeah, we've got the each way, the one, two, three. So I hope there was ladies and gents out there that have done the each way. Um, as I've always said, if you've got the option of doing each way, do each way. Because that was a good price you got for So Perfect at 92. Um, it's run a good race. Yep. I ran a good race. That'll only come on from the race as well. Soft isn't it. So good to soft isn't it. It's, it's, as they say, it's perfect um, ground. It's better on good, good to firm ground. Even though it has one on good to soft. So the ground wasn't an issue. But it's probably better over good to firm um, and good ground but I thought it was a good race I thought it was a good race um, Dan do the winner surprisingly iconic choice was even a bigger surprise um, I just thought the last maybe 100 yards it's so perfect it was maybe just going to get his nose in front um, but was not to be so perfect is that one to follow I would certainly put it in your, your notebooks because um, this will certainly be going up to uh, grade two, um, be I don't know if it'll go to grade one, but grade might run in another grade three before it steps up to grade two. But I can assure you, if Aidan O'Brien puts this into grade a group two, then that horse is going to be bang on fitness. Um, that's going to be ready for the next one. I would have thought. So yeah, keep an eye on. So perfect. All right. So today, with the exception of Winks, that wasn't a tip because I knew that was going to win. Everybody knew that. But the tip was so perfect, which has came in the first three, which is each way, which is good. Um, Defoe was a disappointing one, which ended fourth. And Magical was simply magical. Absolutely great run for um, the horse. Great ride for Ryan Moore. Um, and that came in first. So... Not a bad day, not a bad day. We got a winner out of it and we got an each way in it. Um, it was just the four was probably, that was probably the letdown of the three if I'm being honest. Because um, we didn't know really much about so, uh, so Perfect. We knew a bit about Magical. Um, but the four was, yeah, a bit disappointing. Alright, so just a quick video for you ladies and gents. Magical got us the winner that we needed. So perfect, got us in the first three, which was good, especially if there's ladies and gents out there that have done it each way, and magical each way. Um, it was Defoe that was probably the let down, and obviously we just have to end on Winks. Fantastic horse, 33 wins in a row. Wonderful, wonderful horse. All right, as I say, keep hitting the subscribe button, keep hitting that bell, you'll get all my videos today, tomorrow, next week, and next month. Keep viewing the videos because you are absolutely doing a splendid, superb job. Absolutely, the viewings are absolutely brilliant. I just wish a lot more of you ladies and gents would hit that subscribe button. It's a good, this is a good channel. An honest channel, truthful channel. There's nothing BS on this channel. Absolutely not. It's all straight up front. Um, and as I say, I'm here all the time. Whether we win whether we're second, whether they were third, whether they were fourth, whether they were fifth, I'm here to explain, hopefully, um, the reasons why maybe So Perfect has finished third. Maybe it needed the runners. I'd mentioned yesterday that a lot, not all of Aidan O'Brien's horses, but a lot of his horses need their first run behind them. And this could be one of the horses, but I do think that So Perfect will go on to better things after this. 
Um, Defoe was disappointing. Um, maybe wasn't fitness wise. Maybe wasn't ready. Um, Magical was obviously ready, and that will be that will come on a ton after this race. So that's going to be even better the next time it comes out. Um, and obviously, so perfect as we spoke about. All right. You ladies and gents, have a good night, and I will speak to you all soon.